Hello, uh, your question was how to create a profile of an existing pipe network on which you have surveyed invert elevations. So you have XYZ for the inverts of the existing pipes. So in my example here, I have a surface model, I have an alignment, I have a, an existing ground profile of that alignment, and then I have some Kogo points that have invert elevations that I've surveyed. So the first thing I would want to do is I would want, would want to create a new pipe network. So on my home tab, pipe network, pipe network creation tools. Give it a name. Set your parts list, layers, surface name, alignment to reference, any labeling if you want to apply labeling, etc. So now on the Network Layout Tools floating toolbar, pick the structure style you want to use, the type of pipe, etc. I'll just use 12 inch concrete and I'll go here and tell it to draw pipes and structures. So, Civil 3D asks me down here on the command line, specify the structure insertion point. So I'll snap to the first node here, next node on this point, last node on this point, and I hit enter. Now, in order to place those invert elevations, what I do is simply pick a pipe object, right click, Go to Pipe Properties and scroll down until I see Start Invert Elevation and type in that invert elevation, 568.47 and the ending invert elevation and move on to the next pipe right click pipe properties start invert elevation and this will be, I'll say this is a, a tenth below the the uh, incoming invert and end invert 545.99 once I've pressed OK there, now what I want to do is I want to draw these parts in my profile view. So I go to my Modify tab, Pipe Network, and then scroll over to Draw Parts in Profile. Civil 3D asks me to select the network, so I pick any part in the network and press Enter. And then over in my other window, I press the profile view in which I want to place that pipe network. And there that network has been placed in my profile.